President Bola Tinubu has received a phone call from the United States President Joe Biden. Minister of Foreign Affairs Yusuf Tuga, who briefed State House correspondents, says the two leaders talked for about 30 minutes. The two leaders exchanged pleasantries and President Biden proceeded to thank President Tinubu for his partnership and for Nigeria's partnership. And in response, President Tinubu also thanked him and the U.S. for the partnership and collaboration in numerous areas and also discussed the issue of collaboration with regards to security in, the, in Africa and in particular West Africa. And President Biden equally assured that this is a partnership that will continue. And he stated, as a matter of fact, not more than, uh, not just once, but at least twice, that the future of the world resides in Africa. Bold initiative of uh, having local um, purchase in local currency of crude re and refining of that crude by domestic refiners and sale of the products in Naira, we have said is critical. It is critical to the well-being of the Nigerian economy. I believe that what happened in the meeting was that all committed to ensuring that this all-important effort is sustained and that whatever the teething problems, whatever the initial obstacles to successful implementation of local sale in Naira of crude petroleum to domestic refiners and the, and the correlating sale of petroleum products in Naira is fully achieved. There's the determination starts right from the very top. From Mr. President downwards, there's a commitment to make this work. No program, no project is going to be allowed to roll back the key macroeconomic reforms of Mr. President. And without investment, you will not have increased productivity, you will not have growth, you will not have creation of jobs, you will not have reduction of poverty. So we are saying that the benefit to the Nigerians of, the, of this policy and of this initiative is jobs, is growth, is encouragement of investment by the private sector, and at the same time, it is the saving of NMPC, the saving of its finances and its ability to operate efficiently and on a commercial basis. And at the same time... Yes, we will use uh, a market determined exchange rate and also the uh, you know crude price. Uh, with that, uh, Mr. President also directed that, yes, you know, NMPC will buy, marketers will also buy. Uh, they will be buying just like any other, uh, this and that is NMPC retail. Uh, at the end of the day, we have also a prison bank, uh, which I think they are now going to be the uh, in, go in between. You know, they will now uh, make sure that they, uh, they, that they are going to be like the settlement uh, bank you know, between Dangote, other refiners, and NMPC uh, in terms of crude, and then in terms of the selling of the products. Uh, this thing will actually revive also a lot of industries because industries that are in plastic, industries that are, you know, in cooking gas, which is LPG industries uh, like aviation. So also industries that will buy, uh, you know, uh, gas oil, not only uh, petroleum, uh, I mean uh, uh, PMS.
So all this, the president now asks, and I said that most likely, you know, the consumption is not going to be that much. I believe uh, with this increase of the price, uh, we, as we are ramping up, because it's a brand new refinery, so obviously we are now at about 420,000 barrels per day. We still have one third to go. Once we get there, we have enough Naira crude, we'll be able to fully satisfy the market. But when NNPC refineries work going forward, then Nigeria will be actually one of the biggest exporter of petroleum products in history. So today, as we speak, the meeting went extremely very well. And uh, Mr. President has also said that, look, he will support domestic industries. And by supporting domestic industries, you know, he is not going to allow our refineries not to work. So our refineries will work. And uh, also, you know, it will be a win-win situation where now, yes, we will attract more investment into the country. Uh, so with this, I can uh, tell you that, yes, the meeting uh, went extremely very well.